Hello, it's Mother's Day, and that means I can do whatever I want. So, I'm going to clean. I've noticed that recently, being at home, I, I just feel very stressed out and anxious, and it's because our house is so messy all the time because we have so much stuff that we don't need, and it's all cluttered, and I want to have a house that I am in that's clean and not cluttered, and I know that that would really help how I feel at home and how I approach life. So, I started reading the book, The Life-Changing Magic of Tidying Up, and it's actually really good. It's kind of weird. She's the lady who wrote it. She's kind of kind of funky. A lot of what she says makes sense and you really just need to get rid of things that don't bring you joy. I know it sounds kind of crazy, but I'm going to try it. The first thing you have to do is sort through your clothes. So you have to get all your clothes in your house, pile them up, handle each one and hold it and ask if it brings you joy. And if it doesn't spark joy, you get rid of it. And I know I have way too many clothes. Like this is my closet right now. I wear maybe three pairs of these shoes and I just keep them cause I'm like, oh, well maybe I'll use them and I never do. Just a bunch of crap that I don't need or ever wear. And then my whole dresser is full too. Just waiting for you, boo. For what? I gotta get started. Do you want me to get out of the way? You can be in here, but you're right in my spot. <laughs> I would love your company though. Well, this is embarrassing. I had no idea I had this much crap. Let's see if I can give you some perspective here. This is me in the middle of the pile. It's a lot. And so now what I have to do is go through every single piece of clothing, hold it in my hand, and ask if it gives me joy, if it sparks joy. Does this top bring me joy? Yes. I don't know. Look who has decided to join me. Phil's going to pick up lunch. So I get some tray time. You gonna help me hang things, something? Okay, you sort the hangers into whatever kind of categories you want. And I'll be over here folding. Ta-da, the bedroom looks almost normal again. Here are the two bags that are going to Goodwill. Garbage. And now for the final reveal. Trey, you messing up my final reveal, bro. Ta-da. So here we have dresses, jeans, shorts, skirts, pants, all that stuff. It's not exactly arranged how it says to in the book, but I did it based off of what would work best for me and what I know I could keep up with, and I'm really happy with it. I have stuff in drawers too, like bathing suits, bras, underwear, t-shirts, workout clothes, stuff like that. This is just the first step among many steps that I'm gonna need to take to get this house in order, but I feel good about having this all done. I'm really, really pleased with how it turned out. I mean, some people who are going to Goodwill are gonna be real happy. Hey oh. What up? Phil cleaned the kitchen, I didn't even have to ask him, and the living room. And part of my own office, but that's not public space. But I'm still proud of myself, but I'm not fully proud of myself because I'm not fully completed. But hey, I got some deep ass, deep ass prime rib. <laughs> he thinks he's funny. I'm hilarious sometimes, like a third of the time. This video is probably seriously lacking in some trayness. Your royal trayness. The problem with Trey, I gotta say this, the problem with Trey is he gives me too much inadvertent game. Single moms are attracted to this child. And I don't know what to do when a person talks to me. Cause there's no end game. I'm like, yep, yeah, uh-huh. Now your kid's cute too. And you only go this way. They're probably like, why are you at the park with your kid on Mother's Day? Does he need a mommy? <laughs> what about we go clap, 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 clap. Say, come on, mama. <laughs> Both of them. <laughs> I've been eating poorly for three months. Oh. So, you got up with Trey, you spent all day with Trey, and it's not even five o'clock yet. How you feeling? I don't get paid enough. <laughs> he knows what I go through! It's fun though, but I'm just so tired. Yeah, it's fun. It's a blast. It's like the best job ever, but it's exhausting. And while we're talking about this, Trey is trying to eat dog food. Ah. You might be the most stressed out cook ever on the planet. I blame you somehow. We got him! 
Where did you put the cod holder? Where did you put them? Oh, oh, in the drawer where they belong. Very time sensitive. Thanks for dinner. No problem. And everything you did today. <laughs> if I ever OD on anything, it's gonna be these. <laughs> Way too many damn vitamins. I those You're supposed right. to have two a day. I've had six. Your bones are gonna be too strong. I'm, my metabolism's gonna be too fast and I'm gonna have too much energy. I got my biotin for my hair, my fish oil for all that shit. I don't I don't know what it does. I've just been told I should be taking it. All of the lights. Good Mother's know. Day. I'm so tired. I've, been, I've wanted to go to sleep since four. But, well, I've, I've had too much wine, so I want to take advantage of you. So. Hey there, handsome man. Oh God. Y'all, this haircut. I'm not digging it. Speaking of hair, I think it's time for this muffin to get a haircut. He's got a little rat tail going on in the back. <laughs> it's okay, buddy. Hey! It's just water. Much better, huh? Much better. This is the first, well, the first time he got a haircut, he was 10 weeks old and he cried. And then all the other times he's been perfect, he hasn't cried until today. I'm in here trying to edit and Trey is taking a nap. His timing is kind of off today, but he is just talking up a storm. Not crying or anything. Okay, seriously, of course that happens. I go to show you him talking and he just lays down. But he's like, bah, 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 bah. This mustache man has been on the struggle bus with his naps the past two days. He slept for 30 minutes yesterday. I know he's not gonna go back to sleep, but I just wanna sit down for a second. And then maybe a total of an hour and a half today between this morning nap and this afternoon. But I'll take the cuddles where I can get him. Maybe it's because he hasn't pooped today. He's constipated. But hey, guess what? The whole time I was pregnant with you, I was constipated. So this is payback, right? This is payback. I've always bought the little watermelon like pre-cut cubes and he doesn't like them, he doesn't like holding them. So I got a full watermelon and cut it into some slices and I'll see if he likes it. Cause like he likes oranges when he can hold on to the peel. Do we have a winner? I think so. I mean, not for your outfit, but snack wise, I'd say, I'd say he likes it. What you doing baby Tarzan? You just surveying the, the forest? Uh. Are you waving? He has started waving a little bit. Not all the time, but he'll, like, if I tell him to wave bye-bye, he won't do it, but he'll, like, randomly wave. Like, at Phil or me or the dogs. I'm just be like, hi, I see you. I'm here, you're here. <laughs> there. Are you a monkey? Wow, that wasn't really a monkey sound. I don't know what it was. I don't. Ooh, what's that sound? I wholeheartedly agree. Oh no, baby Tarzan's escaping! He's into the concrete jungle now! This never ends well! You look giant! He looks like he's trying to do a deadlift. <laughs> I'm gonna get you! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Here I come! Here I come! Oh no! You better go faster, I'm, gonna, I'm catching up! Oh no! Ah! Ah, I got you! Today is the first day that Trey will walk to us when we're not holding Cheerios. I brought him to the play place at the mall and I think he saw other kids walking and he was like, oh, I can do that. I just should probably start doing that. <laughs> Let's see if he'll do it. I don't have no Cheerios. Great job. Yeah, you got it. Trey, Trey, he's the man. Say Trey, Trey, he's the man. Say Trey, Trey, he's the man. Trey, 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 Trey. Trey, 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 Trey. Trey, Trey, Trey. Yeah, good job, kid. Yay! Mm. Good job. Oh, 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 God. <laughs> good job! You're the man. Pound it. This is like the newest thing in the past hour. It's awesome. <laughs> Run, dogs, run! <laughs>
Hey, Bubba. You just get back from the beach, bro. Your cool necklace and cool hairdo. It's been a long day. You know, it's been rough on me. I gotta do a lot of baby stuff. Actually, I mean, his brain's got maybe, maybe a little exhausted. He said, Daddy, and he recognized me when he said it. Mm hmm And then he was actually walking. Yeah. And we didn't have to make him a few times, which was awesome. Yeah, and I, I showed you guys, he walks like back and forth to us, but he'll even just do it on his own now. Oh. Like earlier, he saw that cup, and he walked from like here all the way to the cup on his own. We're, we're such parents. I we're know. such first time parents. I felt like I felt like, oh my god, this is the biggest I've ever smiled. Yeah. And it's like and it's probably obnoxious. It's probably obnoxious, but Oh I'm well. Her. All right. Time to say night night. I love you, Pee Pee. I love you, Pee Pee McGee. <laughs> Great job, bro. You're too fast, too furious. Yeah, the star of the Fast and the Furious 94 is right here. Oh, 94? That's yeah. my favorite one. Two tray, two treacherous. Boom. Yay. Perfect dismount! Here's who really edits these videos. <laughs> She's like, let me get back to work, woman. Oh. You're not gonna stay still for me, we're gonna do it this way. It's gonna be uncomfortable for both of us.